So on my Discord, I had people vote whether they wanted a uh, a story time or a Charlie D'Amelio video, and the story time won. But I made a Charlie D'Amelio video anyways. So, uh, you know, now I'm gonna do the story time. Before we start, I just wanna remind you guys to join the Discord. At 100 members, we will be starting our Revolutionary War. We are currently at 50 members, man. 50 members halfway there and to please like and comment if you haven't subscribed subscribe already also the likes and the comments get me into recommended so that would be very appreciated also shout out of the day for you know being subscribed with notifications uh here is dragon gamer every week i will be choosing a subscriber to you know give them a shout out so make sure to you know subscribe with notifications and uh yeah without a further ado let's just start the video and uh lose some brain cells roll the intro <laughs> So when I was 11, there was this kid that used to always try to hit on me and my friend, and we thought it was kind of weird, you know? He was just, uh, he was another dude, and he was hitting on us. He said, oh, we, I only like you guys as friends, but, you know, whenever we would go to the bathroom, like, uh, you had to take a partner, and uh, the kid always wanted to go with either me or my friend. So we decided to, you know, ignore him one day, and he started calling us homophobic, and he said, oh, you guys probably think I'm gay, and uh, we didn't. So, uh... We just, you know, stayed talking with him so he wouldn't think we were homophobic. And all of a sudden, um, he starts telling everyone that we are. And it was annoying because we aren't. So we yelled at him and uh, it made us look worse. So for like two weeks, it was like living hell. Everybody would hate us. So we went to an after school program. And so after school, we met up in our favorite place. And all of a sudden, the kid comes and he's like, oh, hi, guys. Blah, 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 blah. And he just wouldn't shut up. So we decided to tell him, hey, can you like be quiet just for like one second? And everybody got mad at us. And even the teachers came to us and said, we uh, ha it has been brought to our attention that, um, you're being kind of disrespectful and the kid wasn't gay and but he was calling us homophobic because we thought we were, he was gay which we didn't uh and all of a sudden uh we i just snapped i just yell him oh you want me to call you gay okay then okay 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 you're gay and everybody you know was mad at me i almost got my ass kicked because of it everybody was just threatening me and there was this kid his older brother right and uh he tried to punch me, and some of my friends, even his girlfriend, ba uh, you know, bitch slapped him. And he, he, everybody was just hating on the guy for hating on me because I, uh, I was being tempted. And when I finally snapped, he hated on me. I tried to explain everything to him, but either way, he, uh, he decided to keep being mad at me. I said, "Hey, bro, look, I'm trying to explain to you," and he just said, "I don't care. I don't want to hear it." And, uh, yeah, I was eventually, you know, put given detention because of it. Like, how do you give someone detention after school? Oh, well. But, uh, I was pretty mad. I went home, uh, my parents were called, so they already knew what was going on. They said, hey, this is something happened at school, you know, in assets. And, uh, I said, yeah. And I told them about it, and they all, they were like, okay, we don't want no homophobic things here. But we know you're not homophobic. Uh, are you, do you, uh, you know like guys are you gay i'm like no i'm straight but either way it's ironic then the gameplay this is rainbows with the gay pride flag <laughs> anyways um i was just there sitting down the whole uh, you know it was just awkward and the next day of, at school people were just calling me homophobic and it seemed like the kid had gotten away with everything but you know later on it was uh you know revealed that he actually was gay and you know he was talking trash about us and he said how he hated me because you know he thought that i was trying to get him away from uh my best friend which i had known since the third grade so um you know uh, i'm just gonna call my best friend maybe uh something along the lines of uh, edward let's call him edward and the gay kid let's call him michael right so Edward and I are just sitting there and uh, all of a sudden this kid comes up to us and he says, oh yeah, I heard, uh, you know, Michael was talking trash about you and I just want to say, I'm sorry that we all shit on you and uh, yeah, they just walked away and all of a sudden started spreading to the school. We weren't actually homophobic. The kid was just trying to be, you know, ta talk trash about me and, uh, you know, without him wanted wanting to, it actually kind of affected 
Edward as well. It wasn't intentional towards Edward, but it was intentional towards me. And in the end, I just, uh, hate, I hated myself for a while. I thought, man, am I homophobic? Am I a bad person? And, uh, yeah. But, no. The kid was just giving me, giving me attitude. He was just, he just had bad milk for me. So, all of a sudden, I confronted him, and he's like, oh, you're homophobic. But no one was digging that shit anymore. They were like, yeah, yeah, we know you're, like, trying to shit on him. And, uh, you know, that's not gonna cut it anymore. And the kid felt powerless. Powerless powerless i don't i you know i'm this okay leave me alone english isn't my first my first language okay and and all of a sudden the kid he uh he just turned around and went like oh you guys are all me homophobic and no one was having his bullshit anymore so we just left yeah you know it, everybody loved us everything was right on track and uh everything was just normal after that so yeah that was the story time it was a pathetic story but you know my life isn't that interesting uh you know if you want to send me uh stories you know your stories i will you know gladly read them uh i'll in a video so dm me at my uh discord so first join the discord server and you can dm me from there or you can uh, follow me on instagram and dm me uh, whichever you prefer uh my instagram and discord will be in the description and yeah have a great day don't forget to subscribe like and comment bye